Hello everyone. Um, I'm Stanley Ibonuku Chikodli. I'm from Enugu State, Nigeria. The business I do in South Africa, I sell uh, human hairs, human hair pieces like Wivon. Like in Nigeria, we call it Wivon, but back in South Africa, they call it hair piece. That's the business I do. Thank you very much. During this xenophobic attack on foreigners, what are your experience? What do you want to share with with us back there in Nigeria? What I really want to say is, uh, do, during this last attack about foreigners, it's so terrible, horrible, and uh, terrifying. Things stop happening, like business stop moving. I can't even say everything because I was there presently when everything is happening. I even stay in Soweto in their midst. So after work, I will still go and meet them too. It's, it's been terrible all this while. So what I have to tell people that are still there is they should be careful the way they live because South Africans, they don't have, they don't have love for us, especially we that are Nigerians. They don't have love. You will, you will show them many, many love, but at the end, if they want to attack you, they will attack you. They don't have love for us. What, I, what I, my advice is, people that are there should be very, very careful in what they are doing. They should stay away from them. They should not have anything to do with them except business. And after business, there, there should be no intimate relationship with them because there's no amount of love you showed them at the end of the day they will tell you their true character so please my brothers you have to be careful in south africa and the people that have their way home if you can come back that will be very good for you south africa is not the only country that has the best economy ever no there are some other places that you can have a good life too and have a peaceful mind and has like the other people if you can come back, it will be very good for you. And uh, I, I really want to take this opportunity now to take uh, Alan Onyeka, the yeah, Alan uh, Onyema, the CEO of Hair Peace Airline. I say thank you so much for the rescue that you and the love you show for us, Nigerian here. If we tell you guys what we pass through down here in South Africa, what can explain it? Eyes can't tell it all. Eyes can't tell it all. The looting, the the killing, the the everything. It's so it's so heavy and all. That's why me, I'm living. Personally, I'm living. I don't know about others and many Nigerians that are living too. Okay, it's horrible. Even some of us back then are they are looking for a way now to see this opportunity. But 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 here now, I man, I'm one of the people that are that are living. Alan Onyema is like a savior to us. He's like a savior. That's all I can say. Thank you. Now that you are going back to Nigeria, what are your expectations? Uh, what is your dream like? What do you want to do for yourself? I'm expecting now to set my business back in my home, have my shop back, and uh, start my business again. That's, that's my only expectation. It's nice having you. Thank you very much. Congratulations for taking the decision to go back home.